Now, Jason, Electronic Theatre Controls, ETC, yep. uh, widely known for the X7 colour mixing system mm -hmm. as found on the Desire range, the D40, D60, yeah. the XT um, range of LED uh, fixtures. Huge preference for uh, LEDs in the theatre world. Mm. Yep. Now, the uh, Desire range is great, but it doesn't fit into everyone's no. um, price I guess, banned. Mm. So what ETC's done is they've come up with this guy. Yep. This is the color source par. It's uh, considerably more affordable, a slightly different design as well. Um, the Desire range is externally homogenized. You can see the different colored emitters within the thing. This one, you just see, you know, coherent light. I've got it just running on test mode here, uh, automatically generating output mm -hmm. based on buttons I'm pushing on the back. Five pin DMX in and out. Yep. Power con in and out. Um, what's inside? How many LED 40, modules? 40 Luxion. Wow, that's yeah. a few. That's quite a lot. Okay, now other things we should know about this. A couple of nice points on the back for mm. safety wire anchoring. A uh, good solid yoke lock. I mean, it's typical of ETC quality. Yeah, really. overall the housing is beautiful. I mean, when you think of a when you think of a lead par, you generally think you know sort of bottom of the range of, of this and that. But this is um, yeah, beautifully this, machined. Look, and, and at three point eight kilos, it's not you know your typical sort of tin can mm. pressed metal thing. This is actually cast. Mm. Um, you know, we've got tabs here to hold uh, the lenses and the lens options are kind of cool too. Yeah, yeah. Um, you know, you can get a, a lens that, that, that will actually squash the beam down and make it sort of more mm. oblong or even linear almost. Mm. So look, I, I think what they've done here is they've they they've brought the extra red and the, the twist of lime mm. emitters into a new price point and uh, it's a good thing. Yeah.